Today on our 2016 Nissan Frontier, we will be installing the Takancha Prodigy P2 brake controller, part number 90885. To help us out with our install, we'll also be installing the Takancha wiring adapter for Nissan vehicles, part number 3050-P. So in order to test it out, what we need to do is hook up our trailer, which is what you'll be doing if you're watching this at home. In our case, we happen to have a tester that simulates a trailer load. So we've got that plugged in, and as you can see, we now have a C instead of an NC for connection because we do have a trailer connection back there. We're able to do our manual override and see the output that it's giving to our trailer. So we're also able to adjust our gain here. As you can see, that's the output, the maximum output that we'll be sending back to our trailer. We've got our boost over here as well on this button. We can cycle through our different boost settings depending on the size of our trailer. And as you can see, stepping on the brake, we'll also activate our brake controller. Now we're back here at the rear of our Frontier and what you're looking at is our uh, tester unit. You're going to be able to see, actually see on the gauges the output that would be going to your trailer while I operate the brake controller. So as you can see when I step on the brakes, we're getting an output to our trailer. If I go ahead and do the manual override, we can take that all the way up to our maximum gain setting, which right now is 11, but you can see I can bring that gain down and we've got it down to eight. It's going to send exactly that out to our trailer and we can even go all those far down as one, two, all the way down to zero. To begin our install, we're going to be on our driver's side and we're going to go up underneath the steering wheel, underneath the dashboard. That's where we'll need to locate our vehicles, factory tow package is going to be this wire here. The wiring adapter is going to plug right into that. Just an easy snap in place. And this is what's going to allow us to connect our brake controller directly to our Frontier. So what we're going to do is we'll take the bracket along with our included hardware. And that's just a couple of self-tapping screws that's going to allow us to go right into our panel here. It's not a bad idea to go ahead and drill it out before putting in your self-tapping screws just because there's also a metal plate behind there, which is a good thing. It's going to give us extra grip, but it's also tougher just to get the self-tapper through. So I'm going to just go ahead and drill that out. We should have a much easier time running our self-tapper through. Let's repeat that same process on the other side. Now we've opted to, of course, install our metal bracket if we wanted to. Um, we could have used the pocket style bracket as well, um, but this is going to work out better for our setup. So we'll go ahead and we'll take um, our brake controller and the connection on the back is going to plug right into our Takancha wiring adapter, giving us that connection with our factory tow package. And as you can see, we're getting NC right now no connection, uh, there's no trailer hooked up at the moment. So now we're ready to put our brake controller into place. We'll take our included hardware and run it through the sides. Just kind of get it finger tight at first. And we'll just go ahead and carefully tighten that up. Before we do so, we'll position the brake controller at the angle that's going to work out best for us. Something like that so we can see it when we're looking down. It's going to work out great. It's a good idea to bundle up these wires and get them out of the way so we can feel safe going down the road. Let's go ahead and take a zip tie. Get that nice and tight. Go ahead and cut off the excess from our zip tie so then we can just tuck our wires up and out of the way here. Back up under the dash and we're all set. And that will complete our look at the Deconcha Prodigy P2 brake controller, part number 90. 885 on our 2016 Nissan Frontier.